Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So it is officially November and I put up the tree um, yesterday, so November 2nd. Um, I went ahead and I uploaded that video already. So if you're interested on how I decorated my tree, I did post it. So there's a lot of different ways you can put ribbon. Um, it's really just how you prefer. Um, you play with it and you see what you like. So for today, that's what I'm going to be showing you. So I will zoom you guys in so you can see exactly what I'm doing. For me personally, I love for my tree to have different textures, different types of ribbons. So you can get like a mesh one and then you can get like a lace one. Personally, I just think that different textures look better. I will zoom you guys in closer and you guys will see all the different textures that I do have on my tree. So, um, the only one that I don't have because I used it all is going to be this red mesh one right here. Alright guys, so here is a close-up shot of all the ribbons um, that have been assembled already. So, like I did mention, I do start with this red mesh one right here. So, this one is just a lot wider. So, like I was saying earlier, if you have any holes or, you know, big inconsistencies that you can see throughout your tree, that is the best um, ribbon um, to go ahead and put first on the tree. So, you can fill in all those spots, all those holes. So, then followed by, I just go in with a, um, just like the decorative ribbon. Um, you can choose any ribbon of your liking. Here at the bottom is where I kind of do a lot of ribbon because my tree, for some reason, at the bottom, it kind of like falls. Like the, the, the stems at the bottom, they kind of like lean down. Over here too, so this right here, I put this big snowflake um, because there is a huge hole right there. For some reason, this branch again leans way lower than like it's next door neighbor. So I went ahead and I just put a big snowflake. You can never tell. It just looks like it's part of the decorations. All right guys, so like I was saying with this big mesh, um, I just tuck it in the tree wherever it starts. I go ahead and just, I don't think, no, I don't have it started right here, but I just tuck it into the tree and then kind of bring it out. As you can see here, look, there's a hole there behind this one. There's another gap. So it just kind of, brings it together so that's all that i really do with that one that's not too long all you're gonna do is go ahead and give it a little pinch here wherever you want it to go you're just gonna kind of stick it in the back so that you have the stems in the back and if you can see right there okay let me show you right here all i'm gonna do is twist And then, so I'm not doing it there because it'd be too close up. You wanna kinda start tucked in, but just to give you the idea. So I'm gonna go back here. I'm gonna wrap it around the ribbon. I'm going to fluff it up. Then I'm gonna pinch it here about midway and go back again. Do the same thing, twist it, twist the stem around, and just end it. And that is all. All right guys, I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate one more time. So here we go, pinch, pinch your ribbon, get your stem, Twist around, bring it out, adjust it the way you want it, and then run it however you're gonna want to, you know, bring it out. And then when you're ready to, to um, close it out, you just do the same thing. Pinch on your different stem, and all you do is twist. And then from there you can go and like fluff it out, fix it the way you like it. 
I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. Um, I will try to help you as best as I can. I hope this um, helps anybody out who doesn't know how to put a ribbon on, can go ahead and start. And from there, it's just a learning process. You'll play with it. You'll get the hang of it. Um, it's just really like how to connect them to the actual stems. Hope you guys have a wonderful holiday season. Um, but yeah, guys, I'll see you guys in the next video.